Hello and welcome to another new build home tour. Today we're going inside the Samoma by Century Communities in the East Virginia Village community, which is really unique. Is a lot of new build homes. My new build home tours are in Castle Rock or Thornton, somewhere really north, really east, really west, really south. We're pretty much right here in the greater Denver area in the city-ish, southeast of the city, in the Virginia Village community, which is really unique. They're building 72 townhomes, 40 have already been sold, but guys, don't worry. If all these are sold out by the time you watch this video, you can still take a peek around this and see if it's a good model for you. And you can reach out to me and I can put together a list of where else they're building this home or other homes like it. If you're new to my channel, what is up? My name is Tori Drake. I'm a local Denver realtor. That means I do a lot of work in the new construction and resale home space, northeast, southwest, all those directions. If you dig the content, hit like, hit subscribe. Let's dive into the Samoma. All righty, guys, here we are at Samoma by Century Communities. In the Virginia Village community, they are building off of Quebec. A little loud right now, but that's what you get with uh, new construction guys. And I'm actually very familiar with this area because a gym I've gone to for like a year and a half is literally in one of those buildings like right there and the coffee shop I go to all the time is behind there. So uh, it's embarrassing it's taking me this long to get out here to film, but here we are, here we go. Yeah, there's like some cool breweries literally just up the road up there. I live, uh, I live running that way. Got Comrade Brewery right there. Uh, some great food spots. It's a good area. Especially for new builds. Like there's not, guys, there's a, not a lot of Denver, uh, places in Denver, the city, that you're gonna be getting um, new builds. So it's impressive. All right. As you can see, it got a lot quieter just by coming in here. That shows how well actually the material is uh, keeping the noise out, which is great. And uh, Quebec being right there, I don't hear anything. Quebec's not super busy, but it is a busier road. So the fact that I don't hear anything is great. Uh, lots of light coming in, that mirror helps. That's an upgrade, I am sure. Or just some staging. And this address, uh, living in this community, gets you a Denver address, um, but it is, you're also, you get Cherry Creek School District, which is one of the highest rated school districts, uh, which is really, really great, of course. I like that the sink is not right in the middle. They put it off to the right. That opens this space up to use if it was right in the middle. You couldn't really use the left or the right side, so that's just good, uh, good design on their part, to be honest. There is a coffee shop, Moru, that's literally across the street. You can't see it. It's a really strange place for coffee shop, I'm not gonna lie, but it is a spot that I go to all the time and the coffee is very, very nice. Like really, I don't I don't have the, the elegant words for it, guys, forgive me, but damn, that coffee is has a lot of caffeine. It's really good, really high quality roastery um, and it's a cool locally owned spot. So definitely check that out if you wind up moving here. Had a bathroom on the main floor, always a big plus, a necessary plus at this day and age, in my opinion. This is where the, it would be the garage. <laughs> so that's where the garage would be. And you'd be coming straight into the kitchen here. And you got coat closet. Yeah. I am actually really surprised how quiet it is in here. Quiet, it, wow. Quiet it is in here given how loud it was out there. Always a really big fan of having these big windows um, go into the stairs, just brings in that light. When you have those high ceilings, it's almost necessary. So it doesn't get dark. Cause you can already see the, 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 the light change just up here. This is the primary bedroom. We're actually gonna save this for last. Save the best for last. I don't think the hallway lights are on. I don't know where the switch is for those. Okay. Nice deep linen closet. Laundry room on the same level as the primary bedroom. Always a big plus to have on the same level. I am a diva. <laughs> about that. And you got some utilities in the back there. I actually like having all this tucked into one 
uh, one room, the laundry and the utilities. A lot of times, sometimes it'll be like laundry there and utilities here. I was actually expecting utilities when I opened that up, to be honest. <clears throat> the high ceilings are really nice in here as well, guys, on the second floor. Hi, that's me. Thanks for watching my videos, guys. If you like it, hit like and subscribe. How's that for a plug? And then you got two guest bedrooms here, sharing a wall. Uh, by the way, guys, they are building 72 homes, townhomes in this community. 40 have been sold. So depending on when you're watching this, um, you know, what am I trying to say? <laughs> Depends when you watch if there's still homes available or if you want me to put together a list of where else you can get home, this home or homes like it from Century or from other builders or where other communities are, feel free to reach out. Happy to get that information to you. All right, now guys, let's finish off with the primary bedroom. Now real quick, before we go in, I will say I would pref I personally, this is just me, and from what I've learned talking with parents, I'm not a parent, but I would have preferred, honestly, if the primary bedroom was over there and the guest rooms up here, because if you have kids, it'll be, it would be nice not to have the kids like running past the, the running past and being loud, you know, on weekends or anything like that. Again, I don't have kids, but I've worked with a lot of parents, obviously. Um, this is something I've learned that having the guest bedrooms, if you have kids, of course, um, be before the primary bedroom for the stairs is helpful, but I'm being nitpicky. Okay, lots of light. I dig, I dig. Let's see what this community looks like from up here. Good deep closet, skinny, but deep. All right, guys, primary bedroom, bathroom. Let's finish up. Once again, guys, if you want me to put together a customized list of where you, else you can find this home from Century Homes, other homes from them, or any builders on my channel or not, feel free to reach out. My contact information is in the YouTube description, and I do work in the greater Denver area, northeast, southwest. So yes, I'm quite, I'm sure if you're looking in this area, I can help you. Uh, guys, thank you so much for watching the video. Please do consider hitting like and subscribe if you dig the content. If you don't, then don't. But otherwise, guys, I'd appreciate it. Have a great day. Well, that was the Samoma by Century Communities in the East Virginia Village community. If you guys dig the content, hit like and subscribe. And of course, I would love for you to leverage my relationship, rela relationships I've built through doing so much work in the new construction space. So if you have any questions, comments, concerns about new construction or resale in the greater Denver area, feel free to reach out. My contact information is below. Thank you guys for watching the video. I'll see you on the next one.